On today's episode of Tech Tip, we are continuing our MyStyle tutorial by showing you how to customize your EAS sensors within your device. This will allow you to change the name of each sensor that you are running and will make it easier to locate them on your gauges. Before we get to MyStyle, let's go and connect the device to your vehicle. You will want to make sure to connect the EAS sensor plugs into the back of your device first and then connect your OBD2 plug into your device second. By connecting the cables in this sequence, it will allow your device to recognize the EAS sensors that are connected while your device is powering on. Once you reach your main gauge screen, you are safe to disconnect both cables from your device and head to the computer. Don't forget to bring the device with you and leave the EAS cables in your truck. We do not need them anymore. Once at the computer, let's go ahead and open your MyStyle software and plug your device in. Once again, you will select the device with the serial number that you are using. This time, you will notice that the Customize EAS Devices icon is available to be selected. Go ahead and click on that icon to bring up the EAS menu. Depending on how many sensors you hook up at your truck, these sensors will be available to be selected and customized. I am going to select the universal sensors to bring up the customization menu. From here, you will notice a few things. The serial number of your EAS sensor is at the top of the page. This matches the sensor on your truck. Because I chose to change the Universal Input EAS device, it has two sensors associated with it, sensor A and sensor B. From here, we'll be able to change the gauge name, long name, description, and what type of sensor it is and the value it will read. Let's start with sensor A. I am going to choose to name the gauge Trans T. This is what will be displayed on the gauge screen in your vehicle. For the long name, I will use transmission temp. The description will be transmission temperature 1. For the mapping drop down menu, this allows you to select which type of sensor it is and what it reads. Let's select temperature sensor brass. Continuing on to sensor B, we want this sensor to read boost in PSI, so let's change the gauge name to boost 1. Long name to turbo boost. Description to turbo boost 1. Let's change the mapping to pressure sensor 0 to 100 PSI. Now, let's show an example of how to customize the EGT probe sensor. Go ahead and select save to go back to the EAS menu and select the EGT icon. You will notice this menu is a lot simpler. All you have to do is change the gauge name, long name, and description. Let's go ahead and change those. Go ahead and select save. This will take you back to the EAS menu. From here, select save configuration to save all of what you have done to your device. Now, close MyStyle and take your device back to your vehicle and look for the new gauge names in the PIDs list. For more information or help with customizing your EAS accessories, contact our technical support department at the number on the screen. They will be glad to help you out. 